Hello everybody, you're watching Ad Free Tenacious Viking TV. Welcome back to Production Line. I'm Tenacious Viking, your your car factory manager host. Well we have this here list here line here that's not getting used because by the time this thing gets done, this is waiting for the next one. So we got to do something fancy and that means wasting a, uh, a chassis because <clears throat> I'm going to put a move fit body frame over to here and uh, mm, wow this is kind of weird all right you won't get through there all right we're we're, we're good yeah As soon as this gets by, I'm taking this out and adding fit body frame here. Shook. And putting the conveyor back in. <laughs> okay, so now I can thread the needle here with a. Uh, um, I'm gonna save as much space here as I well as I can. Whoa! See if I can get some chassis to go. No, because they're going the wrong way. Dang it! Uh. In fact, I got the whole thing going the wrong way. Uh, I'm so dumb. Okay, let's... Uh... I have to remember that these things are directional. And furthermore, that I'm a big dummy. So let's see what happens now if a uh, chassis actually makes its way onto this <clears throat> and, and fires up this entire line because right now it's doing absolutely nothing. And I still don't understand why uh, some of these things won't break down properly. I, 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 I'm a little confused. To me, um, everything that you have broken down at the lowest level. If you've got these two, then you don't need this one. But I'm not sure that that's accurate. Bottom trim. I don't remember bottom trim being in the mix at all. That's odd. Huh. So I'm going to stick to these three for now, and I, I may experiment uh, off off camera with uh, with some of the others, but I uh, I really want to focus on getting this line going because our productivity is kind of low and I think that's hurting our profits yes it is did get some more uh, oh we're up to 10 okay that's good that's good um, <clears throat> also have to watch see it's they're not going this way why won't they go this way when there's dang it Um, there. I have to do that. That is so dumb. Oh my gosh. Uh, all right, now we're caught up, kind of, and we have this line running. Now let's see what impact that has down the down the road a piece. Because we'll get down to here and everything comes together. Um, do I have... Do I only have one fit electronics? I guess. Okay. 
<clears throat> and this is oh wait ah, I need to see what this looks like from a distance because uh, now I'm confused uh, if I go to, to blueprint okay this has fit engine oh accessories okay these are all the accessories and those are split out on here they are not on here yet for some reason I should probably do that shouldn't I on the other hand I don't know that don't know that I need to uh, this seems to be what is this this is going from paint to fit engine fit engine is, is holding things back here and it is here as well because I can't get uh, so does that mean that I'm making the same mistake here that I simply need to go in and um, do one of these uh, might as well go all the way over I guess and we'll do the same thing here and see if uh, those vehicles coming out of paint want to go want to go to a different uh, fit engine section and make better use of that. We're gonna keep messing around until we get this. Uh... Did I do that the wrong way? I think I did, didn't I? I'm so dumb. Oh my god. See, they they won't do it. They just they won't go over here. I wonder if I should have that here instead of up here. Does that make a difference? Let me see if any of these go. <clears throat> so far they're not. things up see if we can get a better idea of what the heck is going on I mean we have a few cars going through these two center ones but most of them are being run through the outer ones and and they're not keeping up because they're getting everything so then what do we shut down the two middle lines and just not use them and save money <laughs> um, I don't like that option but at least we're getting some productivity out of these two lines now um, I wonder if that's improving the uh, overall stats any not not really we're still 50 percent waiting for next vehicle hmm. and, and almost a quarter waiting for the next slot which oh good lord now yeah, which is dumb oh, oh okay now we're now we're waiting and we were actually doing better. Broken down. Got that. Yeah, waiting for next vehicle is about half now. Uh, ugh. Square meters per vehicle. <laughs> I don't. I don't ever want to look at that stat again. <laughs> it's like six acres to produce this car. Oh man, look at this lineup. This is this is all going really well up to this point. And then well, you know, I mean the paint is keeping kind of busy. Um I guess. These are keeping kind of busy. It's uh fit accessories is not 
getting enough work. So fit engine is the bottleneck right now. How many parts are there to the fit engine? One of your marketing campaigns is finished. You may want to launch a new campaign, otherwise your brand awareness will fade over time. I got another I got a print campaign coming in twelve hours. Effectiveness forty eight percent. Extra customers, extra sales, extra revenue. Wow. That is awesome. Uh, do I have more marketing research to do? I think maybe I do, but I'm not sure where that is anymore. <sighs> Administration, marketing, print, movie marketing. Oh, let's, let's add that to the queue, and let's also add expedited sales, whatever that does. Export specialization. I'm, I've got that. Okay. Great at slot paperwork. Paperwork. Where's the paperwork slot? I don't know what that means. Uh. All right. Uh, do we have that? Is that? Oh, that's that's researching right now. Okay, I don't know if I need. Well, I should probably add that to the queue too. We can put a fast engine in one of the sports cars and clean up. My Roomba is making a real racket uh, on the floor above me, uh, and I don't even know where it is that it's above me. <laughs> I don't understand where that part is. Oh well. It's a little distracting. Clunk, 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 clunk. I think we're getting most of the uh, Our brand awareness and perceived quality are actually down. We're gonna let's see. What, what do we? Uh, I don't really want to launch a TV parallel to the print campaign. I'd rather overlap it a little bit. Uh, but the perception is uh, not as good. Um, it actually dropped a little bit. So we'll have to do. cars are moving too fast. Compact off road. I really don't need to raise the prices. Put a little better separation here. You know, we're making some decent money. We could we could make more, but we'll see how uh how the COH is going cash on hand. What's going on here now? Insufficient resources. Okay. It almost feels like it's time to add on another section, but I'm not sure what I want to do next in terms of uh, improving the... the production um I, i'd almost like to have yeah i could you know i well I, I got room for another chassis line here so i don't really need to use something for that but i could move um the uh fit body section uh this i could move this one uh over here out the outside and i don't know i could i, I might be able to use that for that i'm not sure 
I'm more interested in using these for building parts to add to the, um, the assembly line. I think that's a, a better use of it. Now eventually I could move Oh, I don't know what I have a would I have an export. See, I don't know if that's an export or not. But I could move the uh, the inspection and things out here, and then and then go out here to uh, to export if I wanted to. Uh, that's that's an importer, really. So this is an export. That would be that would be sweet if I could do that. I could move everything from here to the to the big door uh, over to here. Hmm. It's not that expensive. Oops. Hmm. <laughs> We really need fit engine to be more productive. I think what I have to do is expand fit accessories for both of these, which will give me some space here. I should see if I can get fit engine to work here. I don't think I can because there's one, two, three, four, five minimum. And I'll bet you they're big. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight squares. I could make it nine. I wonder. Uh, two, <laughs> three, or five, six. Hmm. Rival companies research power steering adjustment. Adjust. Oh, okay. In-house local component production. I'm not making anything in-house. Um, I should be, but I'm not. Features. What was that? <laughs> I better go check uh, the features and again and see what I'm missing that should be on everything. I could do a, uni a universal only kind of strip down um, sedan and then add some magical things to it. Most of these are very rare yet, except for paint. I think I have those, don't I? I'm pretty sure I do. Light green, dark green. Why is the resources things the same as fit body? It's confusing. What other choices do I have? I got the new power plant, but I don't care. Give me cake corn and I don't care. At the new research center and I don't care. Advanced manufacturing, I got nothing. <laughs> steel sheets. Oh, jeez, I'm gonna just make the steel sheets even. Oh man, this is gonna get complicated. I don't want to do this anymore. Yeah, I do. I'm kidding. So fit engine, I could just I think make it um, in separate. I have to try it here. Um, I, I don't have time to do it in this episode because my time is up.
Do you hear that? That was it. The timer went off. That was the two, one. Uh, okay, so I gotta. I want to try to separate out fit engine here and see if that uh, see how efficient that is. And if it is, I can do that all through this. I also uh, just automatically do uh, fit accessories. Split that out up here because that seems to be working really well. And that'll give me the space to do other things here if I need to. If and I won't. Because I'm not happy about these things not sharing <laughs> uh, the load. That's, uh, I don't like that at all. Not at, oop, not at all. Um, kind of debating here how, uh, We're, you know, we're running just one at a time through here, whereas we have all the backup is happening here. Well, that, that backup is kind of gone, so that's something is moving those along really fast. I need to figure what out what that is. I guess it's splitting out the uh, the body components, huh? Is actually working. So that means I should do more of that. I'm not sure how to do that. Can I fit all those into here if I snuggle a little bit? Just barely, maybe. I don't know. Oh, boy. I really kind of like to move paint up one, but I, I'm not going to do that. I just, I'm not. Nope. Not going to do it. Wouldn't be prudent. And then I'm going to run into trouble here because i got a maintenance department. Shoot. I might have to move that. I don't know if I can move that down there. Well, this is not going to be easy. Uh, it's just, It's just not. It's just not going to be easy. Nope, not at all. But it's interesting, I think. I mean, it's a, it's an interesting challenge. And I don't know, are there different ways you can play this and, and do this better and more efficient? Possibly. I, I, is it worth it? Uh, I'm not sure. But I'm kind of, I'm having fun playing this. Um, this is, uh, I, I like these kinds of puzzles, <laughs> I guess. I'm weird like that. Um, so anyway, thank you for watching. Um, welcome new subscribers. If you haven't subscribed, you know it's really easy to do. You just hit the subscribe button. And, and if you want to know what I'm doing uh, when I release videos and stuff, um, hit that bell beside there and, and you'll get a notification. So you don't miss anything. Don't fail to miss the next episode of Production Line. So anyway, thanks again for watching. Join me next time with Tenacious Viking Plays Production Line, the car factory simulation. And remember, be kind and upgrade all slots. Oh.